Welcome back. Where have we been? That's kind of the question. We took a very long break. How long was that? August, September? I think I posted a video. No, I posted a video in October, but it was September's video. That's how bad I was about it. So, I'm gonna try to just make this short, short and sweet here. So, um, we sold our house. Um, in August, we started doing like little repairs, getting it ready, talking to our realtor. By the end of September, we listed our house. We did it because it was a really good time to sell a home and it wasn't our forever home. We want to build a home and that is our next step in what we plan on doing. Um, probably not for like, I don't even know. I mean, we're, we're really content where we are right now and we're enjoying just relaxing because we were so busy for months. I don't know. I mean, anybody who's ever sold a house out there, I thought buying a house was stressful. I think selling it is more stressful because you have to leave, people are doing showings, they wanna come at times when you're busy, and especially if you have kids and a dog like we do, you gotta take your kids, you gotta take your dog, you're going to, out to eat or you're going shopping so you're spending all this money that you really don't need to be doing. And all these strangers are going through your house. It's just weird and I don't ever wanna do it again. <laughs> but we did it because it was a good time. All the process of the house selling was going through like the holidays. Like I didn't even do any Halloween vlogs, Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's, none of that. The kids' birthdays, because Ethan's in October and Gracie is in December and Quentin's in December. Brady's actually coming up here pretty soon. He's our April Fool's baby, April 1st. We are just kind of popping in here to let you know that we're not gonna be like daily vlogging. Basically, I think vlogging's kind of like going down. Like nobody's really vlogging much anymore. I mean, it's, I don't even see a lot of like makeup stuff as much anymore like it used to be. But basically what it's gonna be is we're going to keep the one channel, this channel right here, The Brights, as it is. And they'll be once in a while. And I don't even have a set schedule yet. I plan on posting videos now that everything's calmed down one, two, four times a week. It's probably not a good estimate. <laughs> two to, one, two, two to four. One, two, four. <laughs> one, two, four. No, probably like two to four times a week. Now, all of our videos are probably, they're going to be different. It will be a video that'll be something that we're doing fun as a family. Um, it could be a vlog that day if there's something really interesting going on. Um, oh, let's see. Um, I love, as you may know, if you are following us from like my radon stuff, um, farmhouse stuff, things like that, shopping videos. I will be doing lots of different season hauls and different like decor videos and shopping, shop with me's, um, recipes, things like that. If that is things that you're into, this is definitely the channel for you, so smack that subscribe button if you have not done that yet, and click the bell so you can get notified every time we post videos. We would greatly appreciate it. But the kids are still gonna be in the videos, they're actually missing it. Couple little quick updates is Ethan is graduating this year. He basically only has two more months of school, and then he will be done. And he is, um, well, he, if we're done with school in May, he's already doing college classes, but he'll be done in May and then he graduates June 7th. That is when he will be getting his diploma. And on August 11th, he leaves for the Air Force. He's already sworn in. He's done his, what do you call it, ASFAB? Maps, I think is what you call them. He's already done all of that. Um, he is very excited. He leaves August 11th for San Antonio, Texas to do his basics. Is it basic training or boot camp? Basic training. Basic training. And then he actually is scheduled to graduate from that on his birthday, which is October 9th. So during the eight and a half weeks that he's going to be gone, we will not see him or really speak to him much. We'll get to talk to him probably like two to three times, the sergeant told me, for about five minutes if we're lucky. 
and we can mail him letters as much as we want, things like that. We're gonna be having his open house for high school, like graduating slash going away party. So it's gonna be a pretty big party that we're having for him in July. We have a lot of things planned this summer and spring and fall. So we're not even quite sure if Ethan's going to make it home for Christmas this year. But after that, then he will take off for tech school and then we don't know where he's gonna go from there. But he chose the job as firefighter as of right now. So he definitely signed on for four years. He may do more. He doesn't know. He's gonna see how it goes. But we're really proud of him and he's doing a really good job. So definitely give this video a big thumbs up for that because that's just amazing. Jason and I are actually on our way to get a, like, a, it's Thursday right now. March 5th, I think it is. Yeah. And we are going away for like three days just to get away because we have not like had a break since the whole putting up the house thing, which we, like I said, listed the house in September. It sold and we closed January 27th. So we are renting right now a brand new place, which is nice, but kind of enjoying the renting because we don't have to do any of the work that you have to do in your own home, which is nice. It's a home that we're renting, it's not like an apartment, but it's smaller, but that's okay because it's a whole lot less house to clean and I'm loving that. It's incredibly smaller. It is incredibly smaller, but it's really cute and it's still decorated nice. And I will show you all kinds of ways that you can make smaller homes look super, super cute and warm and cozy. I feel like it's very homey. I feel like the house is homey and we said that a lot, like all of us have. We actually really are enjoying it. So that's what's going on. Um, our plan was that we were gonna start looking at property this summer, but now we're kind of pushing it off. We might not do it till like the fall. I'm not sure, we don't know. We're just playing it by ear and seeing how it goes. And right now we're not in a hurry. We're enjoying the way less stress. So that is our plan. Wanted to give you guys a scoop on what's going on. All the kids are doing great too. I mean, I told you about Ethan. Gracie's doing great in school. She finished out volleyball. She's getting ready to start softball for the first time. So she's not gonna go through the schools this year. She's gonna go through like a, what do you call them? Just a private league type deal. Same league that Brady plays on. Obviously not the same age group. But um, Brady will be starting his softball too. He's in first grade, Gracie's in eighth. And Quentin's doing good. Oh yeah, Brady's baseball, not softball, sir. <laughs> Brady actually gets to do a machine pitch this year, which is the first time, because um, he's been in T-ball. But now he gets to do machine pitch. So we'll see how that goes. Brady's not a fast runner, but he enjoys playing the sport. And that's fine with us. It house. gets, yeah, it gets them out of the house. It's, oh man, any of you that do baseball, softball, you know, it is hot during that time. And sometimes I'm like, oh my gosh, these poor kids, I'm dying out here. But it's just, it's good for them to do stuff. 2020, Ethan's graduating, so much going on, and gonna graduate the Air Force, and Gracie's gonna be starting high school this fall. Brady's already going into second grade. When we started this, he was starting preschool. It's crazy. So stick with us. We've got a lot of things we're gonna be doing. Just wanted to say hi. Um, Jason and I are going to enjoy this weekend and um, we're gonna to go to the casino. Wish us luck. Hopefully we uh, win some money, but uh, you never know. I mean, it's still fun. It's still fun to get out and go, so whatever it is what it is. Ethan, since he turned 18, that boy, man. He's like, I picked up this five dollar ticket and I won like fifty bucks. I'm like, what the heck? That's what happened was he won on his first couple tickets, so now he thinks he needs to get them all. Yeah, the and he goes to the casino. He's been in the casino a couple times now with his friends, and he freaking yeah, won money there too. Banks so at the casinos. Yeah, he's doing really good. He's got another friend turning eighteen in a couple weeks, and they already have plans to go to the casino. And he's so excited. But anyway, so that's about it, and so. I'd like to keep our videos more during the week when I post them. So I was thinking more like Mondays for sure. Like maybe Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. So I haven't decided on a time yet, like when I'll be posting it. It's probably going to be mornings. I don't know. 
stay tuned. Follow me on Instagram. It's at the underscore brights underscore family. And I'll have it right here. It's also always linked in the description below. So check us out on Instagram because comments are disabled. That is through YouTube. Um, so if you ever have any questions, you can always DM me. I have been getting DMs of people asking where we've been. That's where we've been. I hope you've stuck with us. Thank you for all the new subscribers. I have noticed we've been getting new subscribers even though we haven't been posting videos. So thank you and welcome to all of you and anyone who just joined, welcome. And uh, yeah, just stay tuned and we'll be having different videos, but we're gonna keep it all on one channel. Um, Gracie does still have her own channel. Her channel is always linked in the description below. She wants to start back at doing her channel, but she doesn't know what kind of videos to do. So if you have any suggestions on that, um, like DM us or comment on, we'll, we'll put our thumbnail on Instagram. Anyway, give this video a big thumbs up. Thanks for sticking around, listening to us, jibber jabber, and uh, we'll see you in our next video. And remember guys, always look on the bright side.